Hi, I'm Christopher Brenner with the Muscle Doc Method, and today I'm going to be working on the adductors. So when working on the adductors, this is a very tender area to work on in everyone. So we want to be really mindful with the amount of pressure that we're applying into this area. So as I'm applying my oil onto the area, I'm just looking for a real smooth glide over the soft tissue. And I'm going to start off by splitting the adductors into three segments. And in these three segments, we have our adductor magnus, and then you have your uh, gracilis in this area. We have the adductors here attaching to the pubic bone. We're going to get up in here into the uh, pectineus muscle and then deeper into the orbitrator muscles. And then you have your sartorius muscle that comes around here. So there's a lot going on in the uh, inner portion of the upper thigh. So I'm going to take my left hand and using my thumb as a guiding tool. And we're just going, I'm going to use my other hand to apply pressure and just start going over this muscle tissue. And then using the palm of my hand to apply a more broader uh, stroke through the area. Using my thumb to guide, using my fingers to follow behind. So as I'm working through this area, I'm starting to investigate to see if there's any abnormalities in the uh, soft tissues. And uh, if so, I want to keep that in mind to understand which muscle structure that is and how I can effectively treat that. Now what we want to do is take the pads of our fingers and we're going to sink into this little pocket here. And what you want to do is palpate first to find the pulse. And when you find that artery, you want to roll off the pulse because the last thing you want to do is to actually be uh, cutting off the blood supply here. So we want to roll off of that and find more of the soft tissue. Now I have a pretty firm pressure right now being applied downward into the muscle tissue, into that pectineus. With my right hand, I am going to grab the foot and I am going to flex the knee and then we're going to rotate and internally rotate the hip. We're going to come back down. We're going to do some circular motions, taking the pressure off that tissue, reevaluating our position with our hand and where we want to go to next. Coming down a little bit further to that pectineus attachment. We want to flex the hip and then we're going to internally rotate, applying firm pressure into that muscle tissue. We'll come down, give that a little break. Maybe applying fingertip strokes along this whole muscle tissue here. And we'll come back up and revisit this pectineus falling naturally into this depression here in the inner thigh. We're going to bring, flex the leg up, internally rotate, and holding this pressure down and medially. And we'll release. So now moving them into a sideline position, what you're going to have them do is bend the top leg keeping the bottom leg straight, 
Now we're going to fold the sheet over and we're going to have really nice access to the adductor magnus, the hamstring, and this inner portion of the adductors here. So what we want to do first is we want to target this adductor magnus right here and its attachment with the, the hamstring. So I'm going to take my elbow and we're going to start to sink into that muscle tissue and glide down towards the knee. We want to put our hand here to just be aware not to go all the way down to the knee. We want to avoid uh, you know, any type of injury we can cause in doing that. So again, I'm taking the part of my elbow, finding that adductor magnus, sinking into it and gliding down. We can move back here a little bit more towards the hamstring, work that. Now moving up here towards more of the middle portion of the adductor. So if you enjoyed this video, show the channel some support, hit that like and subscribe button, check out the program links down in the description, and I'll see you in the next episode.